everyone this is a video on how to get Neverwinter working on Windows 7 you do not need to disable your system features you don't need to mod your system folders or anything like that I've seen some crazy tutorials out there and it's all nonsense you don't have to do it uh, just follow my instructions and it works on my system so it should work on yours um, it's just straightforward stuff um, so here we go. Firstly, you'll need to download DirectX 9.0 C and use a runtime from Microsoft's website. Reason being that Windows 7 shipped with DirectX 11 and 10, but no DirectX 9.0 packages. So your game won't be able to run that environment. This is kind of unlikely. A lot of old games on Steam and other clients ask you if you want to download it so in case you don't have it uh, it's worth downloading um, I don't know why it's not backward compatible but you know what can you do next you want to search out big w32 dot dll they'll direct you to a site that will install some software that will search out the dll files plus the video codec and video player needed to play the Neverwinter Nights movies plus Kotar 2 and System Shock 2 and a few others that use that player during that time period of gaming. Uh, once you install the required files, you can uninstall the delivery software. I don't like the uh, adware slash bioware that uh, it does to you. I just don't like it. So once you need the files, once you get the files, you don't need the software anymore. Next, you'll want to Google NWN plus SOU plus HOTU patch. It will fix a huge number of issues, uh, mainly the silver skin issue you have. Uh, when picking different colors for your skin or hair and stuff like that for your character so that will fix that and a ton of other fixes and it's recommended even with the uh, GOG.com version of it it hasn't you know it, you can't go wrong I've included the address to the direct download but uh, yeah finally um, we'll get into setting your safe movie to one in your config file but uh, let's get to it so I'll show you I guess me going to the sites that I mentioned at the start and I'm kind of just demonstrating the two exe binary files that you need to download the uh, patch unofficial patch and the DLL that's there on the desktop this is the website you'll recognize it um, you want the middle one that's a download bink w32 dll fixer um, after you've installed all that you can uninstall that program and this is the website for the unofficial patch again even if you have the uh, gog version of the game I have both CD and the GOG version. Um, it's recommended that you install the unofficial patch. Again, you can test the file for yourself, but they're both legit. Uh, next, you'll go into your install directory wherever you installed the game and find the Neverwinter INI folder. In this case, it's called the configuration settings and you want to find the safe movie line and I already had it switched to one but it's normally switched to zero which so you want to remove the zero and put one with no spaces and go up to the top and save the game finally what you want to do is right click the Neverwinter icon icon and go into compatibility and run Windows Service Pack 3 and run as administrator which a lot of games require you to do so here's the game 
exploded. I'll just create a quick character. Frozen North, the name given to the stark and unforgiving frontier that lies beyond the high moor of Faerun. A bleak wilderness where barbarian clans and tribes of giants roam the land. Hilltop, one of many small villages that dot the most remote regions of the northern wild. Anyway, I hope this helped. Uh, you can check us out on our Twitch channel. Just uh, look for Marworks on Twitch um, or YouTube channel and feel free to subscribe drop me a line leave your comments um but i wanted to do this because there's a lot of misinformation out there about people saying it's impossible to get the movies to run on windows 7 machines or uh you know crazy you know insane solutions but like you know disabling the windows arrow which it, normally it does anyway if it's not compatible, but you know, just cr crazy, crazy stuff. But hope it helps. And um, check out our blog if you're feeling generous. And uh, thanks for watching.